Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to Who Dat Devil, where we try to figure out who in WandaVision is secretly Mephisto, the devil in Marvel Comics, secretly in disguise. And uh, of course, we did just see episode 3 of WandaVision, and speaking of that, I am going to consider this episode 3 of Who Dat Devil, just to make things less confusing, so... Even though this is only technically the second episode, just consider episode one, episode one and two because it covered the first two episodes. So hopefully you understand what I'm doing here. So welcome to episode three of Who Dat Devil. And uh, this is going to be a shorter video because there's not really as many suspects in this episode. Um, not really much new evidence as to who is Mephisto. Um, so yeah, it's going to be a little short. Uh, but number one suspect is probably our number one suspect from the first uh, first two, I guess you could say, episodes of Who Dat Devil. And that is Ralph, Agnes's mysterious husband that she keeps referencing. He was referenced once in this episode. And what, we know that the power went out when Wanda's water broke and everything. So the power went out for all the neighbors and everything. And Ag Agnes, went, when Vision asked, like, oh, oh, did that happen to you too? Agnes was like, oh, yeah, but Ralph looks better in the dark anyway. And, you know, that could just be like, you know, she just said it and that has nothing to do with Mephisto. Or it could be maybe he looks better in the dark because he's a devil and he looks very, very ugly. And in the dark, you can't see him. So he he just looks better. I mean, that could totally be a thing there as well. Um, I, I don't know. Like I said, there's not really much evidence of Mephisto in this episode. So I'm kind of like scraping the bottom of the barrel trying to find stuff. Also, another possibility is... That stork that we saw in the episode as well, um, this is kind of just like a random idea. Like, what if that stork was Mephisto? I mean, it probably wasn't. It was probably just because, oh, like, she's having a baby and everything. Um, but possibly it was Mephisto. That could be why whenever Wanda tried to get rid of it, it wouldn't go away. That would be why there was like, kept being, like, that red puff of smoke, similar to kind of like the, the Wizard of Oz with the Wicked Witch of the West, like the puff of smoke there. So maybe this stork is the devil. Maybe. I, I mean, my first episode, I theorized about the, the rabbit being Mephisto. So who who knows? Um yeah, the, you know, like I said, there's not really much to go off of here. Another possibility is maybe the twins, at least one of them, maybe Billy, is, is because we know as we go through the episodes, we go throughout the decades of these sitcoms, and the twins are going to age up. So maybe, maybe Mephisto actually uses one of these twins as kind of like an avatar to observe what's going on, because in the comics, that's Mephisto's whole thing with Wanda, is that he wants the kids for his own and he's the one that kind of set that in motion to have her give birth to the kids and everything so that they can kind of be like his puppets so maybe that could be something there as well but other than that guys like I said not really much else to go off of here um so like I said a short episode of who Dat devil this week um but hopefully we'll have more evidence in episode four of WandaVision to go off of to figure out who is secretly Mephisto in WandaVision living in this town of Westview. So if you haven't already, you should probably check out episode one of Who Dat Devil. And also please check out my WandaVision episode three review and breakdown. I'd really appreciate it if you'd go check that out, you know, boost the views, like it, share it, you know, uh, leave a comment, all that good stuff. I put a lot of hard work into it. So I'd really, really appreciate if you would show some love to that. And also, you know, the first episode and everything like that. But guys, let me know down in the comments below, even though there wasn't much evidence in this episode, who do you think living in Westview is secretly Mephisto in disguise? So thanks so much for watching. Please drop a like if you enjoyed this video and hit the subscribe button so I can keep you up to date on everything that goes on in the Marvel life.